So the best place to work in healthcare award was we were recognized for that in 2024, and that um, was awarded to us from our staff and a survey that they they um, completed. And within that survey, staff were able to express their feelings about working here at Compass. And some of the things that were pointed out is that we are a great support team to one another. You know, this is very stressful work. So being able to support each other in what we do. Um, also being able to um, have some work-life balance, which is so important to our staff, especially our nurses and social workers who are out in the field. So those are two of the top um, motivators, I guess you could call them. So it was an internal survey. That yes. Actually, that's interesting. Mm -hmm. that's even more important rather than outside looking in, I think. Absolutely. You're getting the true feelings of staff, and it is completely confidential, and staff know that. So they're open to answering the questions wholeheartedly. Mm -hmm. There is, we have a whole grief team here, and they provide grief services to the outside community, the students in schools, and their, our local schools, and also staff. So they are available to our staff. Mm -hmm. Now I do see that there's more, um, I shouldn't say more, there is um, support within our um, disciplinary groups. Uh, for example, uh, we may have, we have our nurses and our social worker and CNAs that see um, certain patients in different areas. So that's, that's like a team of, of folks, that disciplinary group that visits patients and they support one another. So that, that social worker and nurse and, and CNA, they work very closely. So they're there also to help each other, but we do have a professional team for that. I'd say over the last 10 years, um, what I have seen is the shortage in healthcare providers, nurses in general. And when I started working here 10 years ago, the talk was that there will be a nurse shortage in the future. And so over the years watching that occur, um, and of course the pandemic didn't help because a lot of people left that career path. Um, so I would say that has been the most difficult, is finding nurses that um, are you know, able to work still, maybe children um, are preventing them from doing that right now, or um, just the shortage in general. So that's a great question. We do um, reach out to the high school counselors who are directly involved with students wanting to go into the healthcare realm or the path. Um, so what I do tell them with the few times I've been able to actually meet with those groups over the years is that um, you know, hospice care is different than health care in general. When you go into um, the health care field, you're going into it, most folks are going into it to help people get better, to, for curing, you know, the whole scientific um, reasons for that and, you know, the medications and so forth. So they're helping people to get better. Hospice is there for comfort care and for dignity. We want to make sure that those patients and families have that support they need. So you really have to have a different mindset. And it's very difficult for people to understand that, especially young folks, um, to understand that this is different, but it's very important. And once someone spends time with us talking about what we do or experiences what we provide, they really are, I want to say, hooked. Um, I can tell you that a lot of folks that work here now are here because of an experience they had. I feel that folks really need to take a minute and decide what it is that they want to do. What's their purpose? And then hop on our website and look and see what we do, what Compass provides the community. And if it's something that you're interested in, give us a call, talk to us. We would love to, I would love to, just give feedback to folks to let them know what a difference they can make. Um, I think that's, that's really important. It's, this is not just a job, it's a calling. 
And I feel that wholeheartedly. And if someone's, like I said, is out there that just really not sure, you know, where do I want to go? Where, where do I want to take my career? Consider it. It's very fulfilling. And we have a, our team is amazing. And I, this might be a little cliche, but as HR, whenever I meet someone in the community, they ask me, you know, where do you work? And I tell them I work for Compass Hospice, you know, there's a lot of organizations named Compass, right? So Compass Hospice is what I usually say. Um, and they all ask me, what do you do? And I say, I hire the angels. And I truly do because everyone that works here has wings. You just don't see them. <laughs>